Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In case you're new here, <clears throat> but I feel all of you are just new for now. My name is Laurine Wariara Monywa. My channel's name is Wariara. I'm here to address about my life update. Why I ain't I was not filming what was happening to me, but I'm in love with the sun. The sunset pretty guys. So let me just sit down and film. But okay, you notice that I've not been keeping my promise of vlogging every week. Now I'm being a squeegee. So let me start my story back last year, quarantine period. Quarantine when it started. So my quarantine was fine, it was good. Okay, I'm used to staying at home, so it wasn't that much, it was just good. I had some friends over, I go to their place. Like that, like that. It was, it was all fine. But in the process of the quarantine, I had to cut off most of my friends. Not like, like some of my friends. Yeah, I miss you guys. <laughs> but it's okay that I just had to cut you off because I had to know, to redo so much about myself. Because I was being used of. Like, have you ever been addicted? You can't go somewhere without your friend. Where's the end of soccer? Bila Rafiki Yako. Where's the end of hotel? Kahuna Rafiki Yako. I wanted to work on that. As in, I wanted to just work on that. So, in my quarantine, that's what happened. I had to cut off all my friends. Then something major happened. My first YouTube account was hacked. Okay. I was telling people it was being hacked and they were like... YouTube says you could hack, and okay. When I came to investigate, it was one of my friends that I had cut it off who gave out my Gmail. As in, I was like, okay, watch and kupe Gmail yangu usetin simu yako. So they knew that Gmail was the one which had my my YouTube. Okay. When I called the person who hacked my account because I knew the person, do you know she nearly nembe? Ali nembe a video that took her to YouTube, took her to Instagram, yako. And I was like, okay. So you wanted my Instagram. By then I was 35k. I'm going to show you guys up here. What had been? I was in 35, and I was still active. So I was at what? 35 to. I was at 45k. Um, so after my account was hacked, I lost so much interest in YouTube, Instagram, as in, okay, I went down having remembered I didn't have the friends who were with me when I was starting to vlog the first times. As in, they were supportive, they were giving me ideas, but I cut them off. Now my account has been hacked. What am I doing with my account? So I was in so much, but anyways, it happens for a reason. So I was... Just talking to God and I told God, give me a sign if you want me to continue with my YouTube or not. And by then, dad, my father brought in a camera at home and I was like, this is a clear sign. God wants me to be back in YouTube. And I was like, what am I going to do on YouTube? So on October, so last, on oh, in my quarantine period, I was skating so much. I was trying to skate as in I was not skating so much. I was trying to skate. Since I didn't end up being perfect, but I went for some road trips for, <laughs> let me not talk much about my skating thing, but I'm going to just, I will post something about me skating. Yeah. And then I will just try, I'm going to, I'm going to update you guys. Okay. It's my brother texting me. I'll be back to him after this. Yeah. Okay. Then. I turned 21 last year. Do you know, in my birthday, you know, like people do wish you happy birthday, somebody threatened me. And that somebody so dear to me. So, I marked it as a bad luck for my birthday, baby. I marked it as a bad luck. So, in my 21 years, no, I wasn't happy at all. It was all stressing. And in the process, I lost my phone, not even losing it, as in, Let me tell you guys, in 2020, ni metengenezesha simu kiyo maratano. The quarantine period, metengenezesha simu maratano, maratano. Hey, atamini kwa nimejaribu. So in the process, unapata, siyuko active IG, 
na kosa interest sometimes i feel it's okay yeah that's what was happening but it all passed yeah we are in 2022 or oh, 2021 oh sorry guys okay and after my birthday i suffered depression mm -hmm. that's that's something i had in me but it hadn't grown that much but it was it was okay had it i stayed with it so much happened i tell you, i promise you guys so much happened to me in my 2020 that somehow i feel like just shedding tears but i'm strong now i'm just smiling yeah so 2020 motion i did my no i didn't do my next exam i went back to school so much happened still now welcome to 2021 within 2020 i just filmed my how my 2020 i just wanted to nikingia kwa my every page i remember 2020 was my worst year yeah and 2021 comes in when with the way phone that same same phone ilia ridika at imagine at 10 10 na mi nongojia ti next year next as in sasa next next day jita kwa next year i'll be all starting from zero adi nilikuwa nime flash simus ji we know that feeling but anyways shit happened simu ilikufa that night <clears throat> and i was like do you know what i stay kutengeneza na tutaishivo so in my 2021 i was i was phoneless i started it off very well i okay i bought my first phone at feb yeah feb and i just bought it because i wanted i had a, an exam i was doing my national examination of building and construction module two certificate yep so uh, i needed a phone very much but i was dating and there was this dude Thank you. He was there for me. He was even giving me his phone. As in kaji ya kurevise na nipea simu yake. Nikuje home ni revise na yo. Then, yeah. Okay, but for now I'm not dating. It shit happened. So we are in Feb. I did my exam. Went for attachment. That's where now my depression hit me so hard. But it was all hectic and I don't know what to say about it. But it just happened. I went for therapy for three months. I didn't stop going for therapy. Something happened. There are some things I'm supposed to let go, but it is difficult for me to let go. So my therapist told me this. Once you agree to accept them, come and talk to me. <clears throat> I'm going to search for her. I think I've just let go so much. Yeah, but it's a good journey. I love that journey of recovering yourself. You know so much about yourself you love yourself as in you appreciate yourself that's how i feel you get in a position of appreciating yourself and that's what has been happening so after attachment i went for like another attachment for some here and there reasons yeah but guys i think that's my life update since now yeah okay next is a project i'm starting of house tours i've dropped to you guys the link below and i hope you guys i'll be here now to continue i didn't want to start posting randomly without me telling you what was happening and why was i not consistent but now i'm telling you guys i promise i'm here and i'm here for you guys now let's let's do let's enjoy this channel let's say we are creating content let's enjoy let's talk you can share your stories i'm here to listen and i don't have friends and i need new friends please anyone <laughs> crazy friends because i'm a bitch and guys thank you so much for watching this video i wanted it to be 10 minutes and i didn't want to edit this video so guys thank you so much for being this channel please subscribe and thank you and share okay life update is not supposed to be shared but you can just share for people to subscribe to my channel thank you Bye. God bless you all.